Hello everyone. It's funny, I think there are YouTubers who film a lot of videos in one day, but they like might change their shirt or add like a sweater, do a little something different. So it doesn't look like everything was filmed in the same day, but I'm someone who like I don't care. Like I'm gonna film a lot of videos. Because I have a lot to say, but I am going to spread them out throughout the, throughout like a week or however many days. Um, and it's just, I just, like, what's the point in, like, faking something, you know? Anywho, uh, what I wanted to talk about was some stuff. And that is, recently I had a conversation with someone. And, you know, I'm just kind of reminding you, me, and this could apply to anyone, that in life there's going to be things that you're going to have to do that you don't want to do. But, um do it anyway because it's probably for the best probably for for better than not worse and you'll grow and learn from it so i'm i'm in this phase in my life where i'm trying to not fight things like i always feel like be fighting everything but now i'm kind of a little more like okay world universe you know whoever is out there you know <laughs> Like, for me, that would be like, God, Jesus, Mary, all the angels and saints, and the loved ones, my loved ones who are no longer here in the earthly form, but in spirit. Um, you know, whatever they're trying to tell me, whatever they want, like, let their will be done, not mine. And, um, I'm trying to not, like, fight things so much and just kind of let them come and go. Also, it was, you know, try, try, and try again. So, try something. And the good news is, if you don't like it, you can try something else and keep trying until you find what you what works for you, what you like, so on and so forth. But it's just funny because, um, you know, I'm having a lot of conversations with my mom about certain things. And I was just kind of like, so, because uh, I mentioned that there was like an aroma in this house and we had like a little baby scare. Uh, my mom was pretty cool about it. And sometimes, I mean, I think parents, they act cool in a situation to, like, keep their anxious child kind of calm, or as calm as they can. Because um, she did tell me, she kept saying, if I thought this was a real problem, I thought this was a real emergency, like, when I went to my dad, she's like, I would have brought the cat with us, or we would have spent the night at a hotel, like, or the 911 would have been called, like, like further action would have taken place. And then I didn't find out, so like the next day, like like later that day, where my mom was like, I got no sleep last night, I was anxious, I was nervous, I was worried, I was blah, blah, blah. I'm like, you were what now? <laughs> so, um, but I think if she was like really concerned, like she said, the cat would have come with us, or we would have gone to a hotel. Anyways, so, um... <laughs> I'm just, so because that happened, it just was like the icing on the cake, the straw that broke the camel's back, it just, I was just like, I don't want to live in this house anymore. I mean, yes, if I would like have a deep, in-depth conversation with you guys about selling this house, moving and no longer living in it and having someone else live it and make changes and, and do stuff, I would start to cry. Like, I haven't totally detached myself from this house and I haven't totally bid it adieu. But, um, I'm getting, like, I think I never barely even had, like, a, like, a toenail out the door. And now I have one foot out the door, but one foot is still in the door. And that night was, like, the thing that I'm just like, okay, I'm done. Can we please move now? Like, get me out of here. Like, I was a mess. As I stated. And I said to my mom, I was like, when? I was like, when's the universe, when's God, whoever, whatever, going to tell us it's time to move? And she's like, they've been telling us for a long time. I'm like, so you're saying it was because of me we're still here? Or like, what? So like that smell, I think, was telling us it was time to go. And she thought, you know, it's just, it was just a smell. But anyways, so I've been trying new things. There's constantly looking for new things to try. Something that I've mentioned, I think, but I haven't really done it yet, but I definitely want to look into it it's some sort of an allergy friendly food service like blue apron or plated or whatever else they're called out there um and have like meals kind of like sent like not like a like a ready-made meal but like you know how those services work where you get all the ingredients you need and they tell you how to make it and you make it yourself so i can like expand my my uh my food 
<laughs> the things I eat, just, uh, what I eat, uh, that's probably the same thing. Just like, you know, I just want to become a healthier person. So, um, that is something that's still on, like, my list of things to try and do. Um, I am someone who, I don't know, I guess you could say I'm finicky, but I also really know what I want. Um, and I know I've been talking about this a lot, and, like, the Instagram I posted some stuff and I was like raving about it on Facebook but I have an app here's the thing a while back I don't know how long ago but a long long time ago I got all these um downloaded these like hypnosis if I'm saying that correctly and I got they're all in this folder right here and I have two like some meditations um mostly a hypnosis guided um uh I do have two other like little apps but I have like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I got eleven. Um, like fair flying, confidence, uh, healing hypnosis, sleep deeply, one for being alone, one for guilt, one for hurt, one for total relaxation, one for the dentist, agoraphobia, sadness. <sighs> I got problems. Um, and I used to use them a lot. I used to, like, go sit outside in the sun, like, in the summertime, put on headphones because it's recommended with this because you kind of hear the guy saying one thing in one ear and another thing in another ear. Um, and then, you know, a few years back, I did try that Headspace app, which I think it's, like, a 10-minute meditation for 10 days. And I did it. It was, like, a free thing. But after that... You would have had to, like, you know, spend money to have, like, unlimited access to this app. I have received two, like, little, like, uh, cards with, like, a code on it to get, like, a discount or something. Or get, like, the first, like, 30 days free. But that was not n enough of an ascent in, in an, a uh, hello. Enough of an incentive to make me, like, go gung-ho on that app. So the app that I've been loving currently from meditating... It's called Simple Habit. Um, I found out about it because uh, I went in the app store on my phone. And um, I was looking for a meditation app and something that kind of had a timer. So like when it's a, something that would, you know, take you to like a really calm, relaxed place. But then towards the end would kind of bring you back out of it but like not so abruptly and like harsh like Ooh! and startle you to death and like un and rattle you and undo all the calm that was done um i want to see okay here we go i want to read to you a little bit for a second hope y'all don't mind um and it was a free app um and it also says offers iMessage app um i don't quite know that Anyways, um, so I went on that and I looked at it. I'm looking at it and it looks cute or a little better. Um, and so I'm reading the description and it says Simple Habit is the best meditation app for busy people. Now, that kind of caught my attention. Am I a super uber busy person? Not as busy I'd like to be. But it means it's going to be easy to fit into your day. So it's like, in my place, a good starting point. Um, meditate for just five minutes a day to reduce stress, improve focus, sleep better, relax faster, breathe easier and more. Recommended by Apple and Business Insider. This was featured on Shark Tank season premiere October of 2017. So it is a fairly new product. Business, and then it goes on and on about like it's featured on this and like all these things and why simple habit. And, you know, it's all in the benefits of meditating. So you can see there's, like, a lot going on, right? So I read all that, and it's stuck with me. I've been using this app for... Where's the app? It'll tell me, maybe. Um, I started it uh, this month of November. Again, don't know when you're seeing this video. Sorry, not sorry. But um, that's what the app looks like when you... It takes a second to like really turn on but um I and what I love about this too so if you're someone who's like how do I start when do I start where do I start you kind of set up a little profile like you say what you want what you know um, what time of day you'd like to meditate and then like a few minutes before so like I said 3 30 um, it'll you'll get an alarm or a notification on your phone that says it's time to meditate so you'll be like oh okay kind of like 
Do you remember Dear? Drop everything and read. Like, the, the principal, whoever would come over the little, like, uh, intercom at school and you'd be like, oh my god. I don't know. But anyways, um, so my little profile here. So, okay, here's the thing, right? I set out on this new journey of mindfulness, zenfulness, and, like, peace and happiness. If you told me, like when I started this, how much meditating I would be doing. And this obviously doesn't calculate when I use mala beads or yoga or any other form of meditating. Um, it just tells me this app alone. So since I used to start using this app, I've done 30 sessions of meditation. That's like practically a month. I've done 157 total minutes of meditating now if I said to you right out of the gate like oh well you're gonna have to meditate for 30 days you're gonna have to meditate for 157 minutes you'd think I was nuts and crazy maybe and you'd be like there's no way I can accomplish that but like five minutes a day and I'm not that I've done it every day consistently but like it adds up and you're just like you look at these numbers and you're just like oh and gee like I can't believe I'm doing this so then, um, there's a little, like, graph. I don't really quite fully get that, but anyway, in your history. So if you look, here's a little, like, calendar. So all the days that are lit and that, like, my favorite color circle. Probably that's also why I was drawn to this app was it's my colors. And someone told me I was wearing a t-shirt that was, like, the minty green and, like, a bluish color. And they're like, I love that color on you. Like, that color is so calming. I'm like, maybe that's why I have, like, 50 shades of, like, mint green slash, like, light, like, a robin's egg blue. You know what I mean? Slash teal. Like, I'm, uh, that's my spectrum, you know? Because it is, has this calming effect. So it says, special moments, one day streak, two day streak, three day streak, five day streak, ten day streak. So, like, at one point I meditated, like, ten days in a row. So it's kind of, like, it's incentive to keep going. I think you can have friends on here because I think I saw something one day um, that was like this girl that I know of. We're in a lot of fitness challenges together through Fitbit uh, and we're Facebook friends. She was did something and I think it was on this app. There's a community tab. Um, oh, this is my friends. Add your third buddy in challenges. Um, oh, I do have some friends on here. I have two friends on here. One was a member since July of 2017. One was a member since September of 2016. That person has zero minutes. The one above it has five minutes. And I have 157 minutes. So anyways, I'm all about... I mean, and it gives you like... You can... whatever, However many uh, subjects you pick, um, you get a free week on that topic if you will and then there does come a point and they always like push like for you to like buy the unlimited access i don't know what that costs i haven't done that yet because i was like all right let's see how far i can go with this app before um i commit and like spend money and honestly i think this is well worth whatever it's it, it costs so what i started doing because i was talking to my friend elizabeth Cause she was like, well, how does the app work? Do you like it? So on and so forth. She started to use like this workout app and I was almost about to ask her about it. Cause I'd see she'd post stuff on Facebook and like, I completed a week's worth of like legs or arms or whatever. And I'm just like, ooh, what is that? Cause I love, and I know it's kind of braggy, but I kind of like when you do something that's good for you and you can like share it with other people to be like, look, it's getting healthy. Um, so I, these are all free. I'm sure at some point they might not be. I got a total of four new apps to to try I don't think I can try them all in a day but I'll try like I don't know here's what we got right these apps here oops okay so there's two 30-day fitnesses they look similar so I was like well what if I did one app for like the month of December and then one app for like the month of January or whatever you know it doesn't have to be that specific. Um, then there's this woman's workout. And I kind of like when things are geared that way. Because I want to tone. Like I want to be toned and like fit and trim and like lose weight. But I don't want to like bulk up and look like. You know what I mean? 
So it's a seven minute workout thing app and I figured if I can do five minutes a day meditating then I can throw in seven minutes of a workout. Um, then there's this fitness one here, this first one, this like little check mark. And that one is specifically geared for weight loss. So um, I haven't really like looked at these apps and uh, like opened them up and such. Uh, but I'm hoping I like one of them at least. You know, I'm gonna give them try, give them all a try. And if none of them work, I might end up trying the one that my friend really likes because she says like easy to use. Um, because I want something that is easy to use. I could take with me on the go and like when I'm like uh, traveling and I'm on vacation and stuff like I can like get a workout in. Alright so you have to set this up. There's three steps. One of three. It says welcome to the fitness app for weight loss. Please read the program details in the appropriate sections in the menu before starting any plan. We strongly advise you consult a doctor. So um, set your levels. There's beginner, intermediate, and advanced. So I'm a beginner, meaning you're new to sports, or you've been training regularly, um, or you're fit and can endure an intensive workout pace. Not me. This is about to shut off. Anyways, I'm a beginner. Um, then you have to put in your pro. My, you gotta 